We're gonna put the little, put the little black post back in. Okay, here we go. What? What's up guys, Vera and Racha and wow today I told you I was going to do a redo the uh, Texan the uh, Texan here 660 PL 660 yeah that's what we're doing today uh so yeah here we go we're gonna remove the batteries Flip that bad boy over like so. Let's get it closer to the camera so you guys can see. And here we are. This is right here is what we're looking for right here. That's it. Okay. What we're going to do now is see these little black pieces right here. Yes, those are clips. Um, you gently pull them out, um, and you gently push them back in. Whenever you put in the, the wires back in the board, one the little clips, okay, and then the, it'll come out, okay. <clears throat> like so, like that. See how I said three, one, two, three? Because on the board here, I'm trying to look to see if you can see it. Make sure I'm not shadowing it. On the board here, you see how it says. BOC mute. A mute functions on the third one. I thought it was the second one. It's on the third. ST blah, 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 right? That's the mute function for the for it. And that's what we're after. So one, two, three. And you're gonna have to cut that. You see how small that is? That's the tip of my screwdriver there, and it's small. I can put the little Alright, so I'd just like to tell y'all, y'all see the, uh, one, two, three, right, right, where the, um, tape is, right? Well, that's three-year-old tape, and when I pulled it out, apparently, um, it would not function correctly. I don't know if the tape's just worn out, you know, or whatever, so I ended up replacing it. Um, I had a, a little struggle cuddle, though. Um, I'm gonna show a little bit of that, but, um... I ended up ultimately kind of pushing it more towards two, okay? Um, going towards the VOC, one, two, three. Uh, because if you do it to four, four is the volume. And if you cover four, you're going to obviously lose sound. I'll show that in a minute, too. <laughs> I figured, well, since I was tinkering it and had it all open and doing it anyway, might as well show it off. So four is the volume, three is the mute functionality. So I actually pushed it more towards two. To make sure three and a, I think a little bit of two was covered as well, um, but it should be just three. I don't know why I was having a little bit of struggle cutting with it. Don't know, but I'll show you here in a sec. And then we've got power, sound. Shit, why is it doing that? Yeah, see how it uh, it's doing its normal functionality, as if the tape's not even on it. <laughs> yeah, we need to fix that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get me a fresh little piece here and a knife, and we're gonna just redo that strip because apparently it's making a connection. In the original video, I had to take the board out, which you, requires needle nose for this right chair. For that right chair to remove this you just pull out the board and uh, there's some screws on the motherboard one two three four um, that you take out and then the board will come out and it'll make getting this a little bit easier than when I originally did it but I don't think I don't think it's necessary anymore all right This actually might be too big. <laughs> We're about to find out. 
I'm gonna try covering three and four and see what happens. Fun. And then we test it. Say power. Oh yeah, see that's that one's the fourth one's the volume. That's what I thought. The fourth one is volume. But it's just scanning. See, and that's what we want. So I'm gonna have to probably thin this out a little bit. So yeah, it was uh, it was I uh, covered three and four. Four was the volume. Three is the mute function because it continually scanned. Just need to do a piece of tape. I needed to thin it out, and here we go. It's a lot easier to use a like a surgical blade or something, but or a box cutter or something. You know what I'm saying? That I would recommend. It's only on three. I'm gonna put it on two and three. See what happens. All right. So I actually ended up covering a little bit of two. And I'm wondering if it's because when I'm pushing it in, the tape's moving a little bit. Um, I'm not exactly sure. Because, uh, you know, I've had it on three for three years, and it's worked just fine. So I don't know if it's just it's, it's the tape pushing it or something, and it's making it was making a connection for some reason. Anyway, so I pushed a little bit uh, towards two as well uh, and, and put it back in there. Put uh, put all my screws back on my casing. The four screws that go around the case, and the two screws that go inside uh, the battery compartment. Also, don't forget to put when you push your clips back in. There is obviously it's got a, it's got a little bit more thickness to it because of the tape. So don't don't be surprised if it when you push in your clips they don't go all the way flush. It might push out a little bit because of the tape. So don't don't worry about that. Um, but do push in your clips back in uh, whenever you put the ribbon back in for the wires. So uh, we put it all back together and we give it a test. All right, so power. Oh wait, power. There's volume. Good. Scan. Let's put the antenna up. Let's see what that And it's working again. All right. So I guess it didn't. I guess it needed a new piece of tape. I aimed for a little bit, going over more towards two and three. So to cover. And it looks like it's it's working fine. Okay. So if you're covering three and it doesn't work, you had to struggle for a second like I did. Uh, go more towards two and three. You don't necessarily have to take off that board, but I remember back then I had problems getting like getting around the board. Um, but you shouldn't need to, I guess. Hello? <laughs> shouldn't need to, I guess. An ass? Was it an ass or ask? <laughs> Anyways, that's pretty much it. I uh, hope you all enjoyed. Um, hope you can see everything a lot better. I know the first time when I made that, uh, this video, it, uh, three years ago, I did not have the camera nor the lighting to do, um, you, you know, you can see right here, it's all, it's all like fuzzy. When I was trying to show the tape. I was mentioning the wires and stuff. That is. So it's all fuzzy and stuff. Uh, you can't really see. So hopefully this uh, helps a lot better um, for a lot of people. And the lighting's a lot better. Um, hell, because I think yesterday, the other day, I got another comment. I remember I, I kept wanting to do this. I kept forgetting. I got busy. Yada yada yada. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So what is the point of this video? What are you trying to achieve? Um, you're muting the function for the ghost box so it continually scans so it doesn't stop when you hit scan okay helping it for a ghost box okay uh, this is like stone central I had flashbacks watching it stone central okay for some reason I watched this POS video this is 12 of the most useless minutes of my life I want my 12 minutes back learn how to 
video things. Go back to school and learn how to talk. You don't use words like Z. Act, act your fucking age and learn how to communicate. Give me my 12 minutes. Give me my 12 minutes back. For someone... Uh, yes, Z. I like to use Z. We're looking at Z. I mean, I don't know why that triggers some people. Um, <laughs> it's so weird that it does. Um, for someone who is upset about stuff like that, it's just weird. I don't... <laughs> No, you can never have your 12 minutes back, Captain Undy. Weird people, man. <laughs> it is what it is. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. I hope that answers your questions. Hope this video is way better than the last one. Much love. Peace. Hit that bell.